Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Zodiac. I am your host, Melee Wizard, and I know I said that I would be starting up in Zodiac, in uh, Virgo, but I was exploring other regions of things, mostly to try to find, uh, em to find uh, ways to get into the empty spots on my existing map, and I found some. And a few of these are ones that I particularly want. And I don't feel like putting them off. Or at least this first one in particular. And it turns out this first one is right over here. And what is this, you might ask? Another wallet upgrade. Considering I'm kind of maxed out right now. Oh, yes. There is another one of these that I actually just found maybe a few minutes ago. Uh, at least for me. But it also costs 409 and I'll show you that later when I can actually afford it. In the meantime, the, first, uh, the next place I'll be going is one spot in Cancer that I, that I had found. I will see you guys there. Alright, let's see if I can... Yep, I can shortcut my way to this one. There we go. And that's pretty much all I found for this, for here. There are a couple squares on my map that I haven't been to yet, but I still haven't figured out what those are yet, so... On to the next one! Alright, let's... Try this one again. Now that I've actually got more health to work with, there we go. That definitely made that easier. And considering what the reward is, it is definitely something that I want. Assuming I... There we go. So yeah, having more health regen. Kind of a thing that I would like to have. Surprise, surprise. Alright, this spot in particular gave me a huge amount of grief trying to find. And it turns out it was right here. And has a rather nasty enemy to boot. And all for a missile expansion. There was a... Uh, there are still a couple of uh, locked doors here in Ares that I that are still locked to me and I'm actually kind of wondering how to open those considering I've pretty much been everywhere else and those are pretty much the only two squares in the whole map that I haven't actually been to so that's definitely something to ponder over and I hope it's not something that's if it's something that's important I hope it's something that I'll have access to later, I guess? I don't know. We'll see. I will admit that these next couple spots didn't really take me long to find. I guess it just, uh... I just needed an excuse to come back to Tara since I didn't really have that much of a reason to come back here again. Uh, after all, I think I had pretty much accomplished everything that I needed to accomplish here.
And of course, the last one ends up being right here. Alright, I think... Well, there are a couple other things, but I... I want to knock out some uh, other things first. Cause, like, there's a couple things in Pisces that... That I probably could do. There's some stuff in Aquarius that I could do. But I think I've kind of sidetracked myself enough with some of these pseudo-random things. It's time to get back to business. So I'll see you guys in Virgo. Alright. Now I haven't done any exploring at all here in Virgo. Just because I wanted to keep at least I tried to keep like major regions a surprise as opposed to these little one room side paths that I had just been taking. Uh, okay. And there is one other reason for me at least taking this way because there is this path here that I can go through. But while I am here... Oh! Did I accidentally grab that at some point? Oh well. I th I thought there was that one energy thing that was there, and I guess maybe I picked it up by accident somehow. Oh well. Okay. It's handy that that uh, the only part of that plant enemy that's an actual hitbox is the upper half. Uh. Huh. So I'm in 6C. Okay. Hmm. Really? I got hit there? Huh. Oh, jeez. Although, the fact that I'm only getting hit for like two damage apiece makes this not really much of a threat. Especially now that it can't actually hit me. Never mind, it can hit me. It's still not a threat. Okay, and that opens up the pa the door in 7-2. Okay, that is good. That is very good. And no, I am not fighting. I have to fight you again. Or maybe I don't. Okay. That was kind of awkward. Although there were, there was the un, the lower part of that area, and I'm curious to see if there's actually anything to that, or if it was just punishment for not making it through. So let us find out. Well, so there is that one door. 
So let's see what's this. What this might. Ah, it's one of these. And now that I can pass through walls, I can actually see what this is about. Hmm. Ooh, efficiency upgrade. Um, is there any point to this? No, apparently not. Oh, okay. Huh. Well, at least now I know what the other one can have. This No, it doesn't look like that would have been a just one big shortcut. Okay. So my curiosity is sated on that front. So uh, if nothing else I'll see you in the other half of Virgo, because there's a heck of a lot of stuff I can do there too. Alright, so I don't think I want to uh, go into that door I opened just yet. But there are a few other things on this half of Virgo that I can definitely do. Let's see, where am I now? Seven? Okay. Probably could have picked a closer spot to pick things up on, but... Oh, uh, well. Alright. So what... do we have over here? Ah, it's it opens up the that wall in o, in a zero E. Well, that's very good. Ah, there we go. Yeah, I'm just opening up passages all over the dang place now. And now that I can pass through walls, I can make my way through this place a lot faster than I could have before. Alright, so what do we have in this one? Power upgrade! That is also very nice. So what does that put my stats at? 2018-20. Alright. Yeah, the shots definitely look interesting. Oh, dang, there was two of them. And then there was this one other door over here. So what do we have now? Oh dear, it's another one of these lovely things. Ah, more health. All right. And I'll just regen my health a bit. Hmm. 
Alright, so was there anything else that I was wondering about? At least nothing on this end, uh, this end of things. So all that's left over here is to see what's beyond the door. All right then. So I know there is one corridor that I had not seen in Virgo. And I'm wondering if it's here or if it's on the other side by uh, zero E. Well, that looks kind of important. Uh. Hmm. Ah, I have to go this way. Or at least that was the way I could have gone. Oh dear. Oh geez, another giant crab. That still doesn't do a heck of a lot of damage. I wonder. Nope, that doesn't do much. Uh, I wonder. Does. Oh my, yeah, that does. A heck of a lot. And I just found a safe spot where I didn't have to use a, uh. Energy tank. Uh huh. Well, all right then. Screw attack. Well, that looks neat. And for the sake of completion, if nothing else, because I probably won't go into it now, but I at least want to see where, uh, I at least want to see what the uh, what the reward for the corridor at the end of at the other side of Virgo is. I will see you guys there. Aha! That is definitely something that I'll want. Uh, and I think, but since that was just one room, yeah, there's definitely something more here. Nothing up here, though, but... Aha! All right. Well, I definitely got a lot of stuff done here. 
fact, I think I pretty much got everything done here except for that one, uh, that one corridor that, uh, yeah, that, that's, it makes me wish I had found that one before trying the one in Leo. Ugh. So, I think I'm going to end things off here. So, I guess, join me next time when I take on the corridor here in Virgo. I think there's there's a spot that I can now do in Scorpio that I think might be another uh, corridor, but I'm not entirely sure. And we'll see where that takes us. So, until then, this is Melee Wizard, and have a nice day.